Hey guys, this is the Redstone Warrior here to report on my ALU in Minecraft. It is 16 bits, it is 4 blocks wide per bit, very small, skinny, and it, is, it belongs to the hack computing platform, same as the internet for the winds. I built mine because I felt it was a little large and slow and I needed something fast for what I was planning on building. It's about a quarter the size and runs well. It takes about 3 seconds to respond, so it works as a fast ALU, and its output is actually under over here. There's actually a huge bus which comes from the end over and comes over here, which saves from the del huge lag you get from wraparound buses. Here are the inputs, and it starts by taking in the values. There's one of these platforms for each value the A and D input. It starts by zeroing it. Okay, this is part of an ALU's job. It zeroes it right here if it applies if the control bit tells it to. And then it runs through an XOR gate. If you put the other one to on on, then it has the ability to invert it. That's how XOR gates can work. Then after that, both sides, there's one down there too, the same platform. Both sides go into this custom made anding and adding area. It's 4 bits wide, very small. It works well. It adds from where I am right here all the way down. It both ands and adds it, and it's very small and compact. compact. Then it sends out the values to this muxer. It cancels out the values it doesn't want. It's a neat muxer unit. And then it decides whether or not to invert the output here. Once it's done, it sends the output down the down the underground bus and brings it to the other side. And it also has this is equal to zero and is negative, which comes into when you're considering jumping for the whole AL computer. I'm planning on putting this arithmetic logic unit in a very compact small Minecraft computer so that I can run basic programs in Minecraft without the huge delay you can accumulate by all these bosses and muxers that the internet for the win included. So it's smaller, it has well arranged outputs, and I'm hoping it's going to turn into a computer. To demonstrate, I'm going to add 5 plus 7. I've already set the control bits to addition, so 5 in binary equals 1, 0, 1. 7 in binary equals 1, 1, 1, and the output should be or should be equal to 0, 0, 1, 1, which 5 plus 7 equals 12, 0, 0, 1, 1. It took about 3 seconds for it to calculate that. It is a small, very convenient ALU, and I should be able to turn it into a microprocessor of computers. Minecraft. Uh, that's pretty much it. The hack platform is actually a uh, actual teaching platform, which they have in certain courses, and it's mainly a teaching aid to show how the computer works. So this is the first part of a small version of the Internet for the Winds one. Hopefully, it's going to. Once I attach registers and all, it's going to turn into a legit, legit, legitimate computer. Well, this is the Redstone Warrior, thanking you for watching and saying stay tuned.